Hi, James Wedmore here, and in this video, we're going to talk about what to say in your videos. Using video online is a great way to engage your audience, build a reputable brand, and create raving fans. All right, settle down, settle down, children. And with the staggering stats, over four billion daily views. YouTube is a no-brainer for your online marketing success. Great. So you go and you grab your camera, you get all dressed up, and you hit that record button. But what do you say? What do you talk about? What the heck is your video all about? Well, have no fear, I have you covered. There are several different formats and templates that you can model, but I've put together a very simple five-part outline that you can use in all of your videos. And the best part? I'm actually using it in this video. Talk about leading by example. So, whether you're a golf instructor teaching the secrets of your 300-yard swing, or a fitness buff showing your students how to get bulging biceps just in time for summer, or even a real estate agent showing off that perfect home. This is a simple five-part YouTube video format that you can follow to make better videos and get even better results. Ready? Part one, the attention grabber. You have three seconds to grab the attention of your audience and tell them what your video is all about before they click away and move on. Don't overthink this one, guys. Tell people exactly what they're going to get out of this video and why they should listen. Think big benefit and do it in five seconds or less. Part two, the intro bumper. Just like your favorite sitcom, you need to brand your videos with a four to six second sizzle piece that includes your name, logo, tagline, and some snazzy music. Check out videohive.net and premiumbeat.com to get the best deals. Part three, the content. This is the meat of your video sandwich. Give the juiciest, most bestest content, training, or action items possible to blow the minds of your audience. Use the power of video to teach, demonstrate, and inspire. But here is the most important part of your video. You ready for it? After you deliver your content, you must deliver your call to action. Call to action! Action! Right, call to action! Action! What do you want your audience to do next? Go to your website, a blog, Facebook fan page? Tell them exactly what to do and why they need to do it. And don't worry, my call to action is coming soon. Part four, the outro bumper. Let's end your video with a bang and cue your outro video. This is simply a repeated variation of your intro bumper that reinforces your call to action. Part five, the outtakes. If you've done everything correctly to this point, you should have a video that is three to six minutes in length. Any longer, and you risk losing your audience's attention forever. 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 When your video ends, treat your viewers to a little behind the scenes of all those ridiculous mistakes you made while filming. Why do this, you ask? It's simple. You train your audience to stay to the end of all your videos. You do want your viewers to watch your entire video, don't you? Don't you? So it's all pretty simple, right? Well, I got a very special gift for you. I've put together a very special report and infographic detailing this five part outline and I wanna give it to you absolutely free. You want the free report. This way you can start making more awesomer videos with this little cheat sheet. To get your hands on it, simply click the link below this video in the description box. Fill out your email on the next page and I'll email it right to you. Got it? Good. Now, cue the outro bumper. You do want your viewers to stay, to wait, what? Okay, let's do it from the top. Yeah, I'm recording. Oh, you are? Does it look good? <laughs> it's not it's supposed to happen like that. Are you saying this to me in real life? Yes. Okay. 
Yeah, let's try that again. Forever. Forever.